as it's Mark from Truth Seeker, and I just downloaded the latest Pick 574 mast cam left, and look what I found. It's very. The quality's getting worse, but the artifacts are getting stranger. I mean, look. look what we got here. This I really don't have to. Uh, really don't have to say too much about this. I mean, it's pretty self-explanatory. Uh, this here. To me, looks. I'm gonna call it a bowling ball because it's got a couple of holes in it, and it's totally round. Look at this piece that comes out here. Now, this is a rock. Look at this indentation. This one here, and then look at this piece that comes out. It almost looks like a huge uh, bit that you would use for like a chisel. Look at at the end of it, and you can see it's got grooves in it that are all filled with stuff, but see this hole here we, what I remember if I remember correctly they use these as big chisels and this blows air in here and it blows uh, blows the dirt and dust and stuff out I mean that's what it you know I'm not saying it's what it is but that's what I'm calling it so you draw your own conclusions That's the pick. And we'll come right up here to this strange item. Look at this. It comes down. There's, you know, some type of cement or rock underneath, but look at this. It's like a T or part of a wooden frame. And you come over here to this thing, it almost looks like a strut from the car. See? You got like the shock, the rubber boot, you could see the striations in it. And you come up here, look at this thing. Another outlet. It looks like there's something it's all blurred here. I mean, the underneath of this almost looks like a pontoon boat. It almost looks like pontoons. Not saying it's what it is, but. Then I'm going to show you something really wacky. Look at this all, all blurred. What the hell can this be? Look at these. This is the best I can get it to come out, but look at what they blurred. What could that be behind there? Listen, you know, leave a comment. Let me... I mean, I know people are going to say it's artifacts, but come on. I mean, this almost looks like a crown. Look at these. And I've seen them before. They're not everywhere, but I've seen them before. So leave me a comment. Let me know what you think this stuff might be. But it's definitely blurred. I'll leave it at that. Then we're going to come here. Look at this. It's got a perfect triangle cut out of this. I don't know, like I said, I don't know if this is... I just don't know what this could be. Then you come over to this rock here. They blurred a lot of it out. But this is what's left of it. It just looks like a bunch of junk. I don't know what that could be. I mean, it's just wacky. <laughs> Look at this piece. I mean, how could you hollow a rock out like that? Look at it. It's hollow on the inside. Look at this. This looks like some type of carving. It almost looks like... Uh, flower petals carved into it and it's hollow 
and you see the way they come out like 3D. Tell me that ain't strange. Look at this. Some type of head carved there. Almost looks like there's a person standing there working on something. I mean, look at that. There's, I mean, they blurred some of it, but there's something coming out to here. It almost looks like they're working on some type of machine here. You can see the head, the arm coming out. I mean, NASA makes sure that they're far enough away when they take these pictures and then crop them that you can't really get much detail. Alright guys, this is Mark from True Seeker. Like, subscribe, do all that good stuff. I want to thank you. I really appreciate everything. All you guys do. All your comments, your positive reinforcement. I love it. Thank you. Keep it up. I'm out.